Jim Holly, Supercross Live on supercrossonline.com. Well, he didn't win last week, but it's like a win for him. A fourth, your best uh, yeah. ever, uh, Jake Canada. That was a great ride you had in Toronto last week. Thank you. Yeah, it was good. I mean, haven't got a fourth yet. I was planning on getting a fifth, and I got a fifth, and then now I got a fourth. So, I mean, the next step's the podium. So, what can we do? I mean, I'm just going to go out there and try my best, but definitely was pumped on last weekend. Something else, uh, you've signed already for next year with the uh, Moto Concepts team. Uh, does that uh, take a little pressure off knowing that you have a ride for next year? Oh, definitely it does. I mean, now I don't have to get on the phone and call people or talk to them. Um, they kind of came to me, so I was actually a little like surprised that they came to me this early. And now I'm signed and everything's good, so we can just focus on getting through this year. Just go straight into next year and get all of our stuff prepared. And I think, I mean, I'm happy. I'm thankful for it for sure. All right, what's it going to take here tonight in Houston to get on that podium? Uh, you know, uh, you've had a fifth, like you said, you've had a fourth. You can only keep moving up. Yeah. I mean, I don't know. A podium would be great, but I think from what I've done so far, I'm pumped with that. And um, I'm just going to go out there and do the best that I can and try to get a good start. I was like 16th or something on the first lap last week, and then I came to fourth. So I think if I get a good start and run up there with those guys, I think it's definitely possible. But who knows? I'll just let the balls fall where they lie and see where I end up. You're sitting fifth in the points right now. You're 12 points uh, behind Ken Roxon, who sits in fourth. Is it a possibility that you, man, I, I'm happy with the fifth in points, but I really want to try to get in that top uh, four? Yeah, I mean, that would be great. I mean, a fifth right now to me is even, it's awesome. I mean, I'm happy where I'm at. I was in sixth, and then now I'm ahead of Baggett and Baggett and Bogo right behind me. So, I mean, I got guys close in front of me, and I also got guys close behind me. So, I mean, I'm concerned. So, so you're in the mode right now to keep Bogo and Baggett behind you? Yeah, keep them behind me, but I mean, obviously, if, uh, if there's opportunity to move up, then I want to move up for sure. Let me ask you this. Is, is this what you expected this year in 2012 out of yourself to be sitting right where you're at? Or are you thinking, man, I, I've uh, exceeded where my expectations I thought I was going to have in 2012? I think I exceeded my expectation. I know I had the speed. I've known I've had it all, but I haven't really had everything put together the way I'd like to with my training. and. Now I got my trainer Charles down. We've been working really hard. The team's backing me 100%, working really hard. And uh, my goal was to be to get a top five by the end of the season, just get into the top five. And now, and I wanted to be top ten. And now I've gotten a fifth and a fourth and been pretty consistent. So I mean, the only next step there is is get a podium. So. That's the key is, is a privateer. I mean, you know, you, you, you got to have a, a, all the pieces of the puzzle to be successful. You talked about a trainer. You got the team now. You know you can do it. You have the confidence, the speed. I mean, what was lacking before? Just you didn't have the bike and the equipment? I mean, it was a lot of stuff other than that. I had, I definitely didn't have the bike and the equipment. I was just privateer on old bikes, and it's definitely nothing compared to what I'm on now. But I think it was just everything. I didn't have a good training base. I didn't. I wasn't really giving it the full 100% that it needed with everything, with everything, and I, I'll admit that. And I think now, at the beginning of this year, before this year in the off season, I've been working really hard, and I think we got everything together now, and it's showing, and it's finally putting it together. So.